Hey, hey folks, how are you today? Keila here. I hope that you are having a wonderful, wonderful day today. I am, because I'm getting some stuff done. Just got to meet with a contractor about trimming my bushes, because they're getting kind of wild and gnarly. Anyway, um, I wanted to talk to you today Maybe I should introduce myself first. I'm Keila. I was a stay-at-home mom of two little ones, 17 and a half months apart. I was one crazy, stressed out mama. I was in a daze between the diapers and the dishes. It was intense. It was hard. I know what you're going through. It's not easy, not easy, and I know that. So we're gonna talk about some ways for you to do some self-care with the kids around. You're probably thinking, self-care, really? One more thing on my to-do list. Well, we're gonna make this easy, we're gonna make it simple, and we're gonna make it so your kids don't feel like you're taking time away from them. We're gonna do it right there with the kids. Does that sound like a good idea? So, why is self-care important? I mean, you hear it all the time, everywhere. Well, taking care of yourself is so important. And self-care can be, well, let's just dive in. What, it, what is self-care? Self-care is anything that lifts your spirits, that fills you up. That's what self-care is. Is self-care a hot bath? It can be, if you like baths. Some people hate baths and that's not self-care then for them. Some people, it's a walk in nature. I mean, there's just, there's so many ways that you can fill up your cup. That's another phrase that we hear all the time. Fill up your cup. What are you talking about? Well, when you give to your kids, when you give to your spouse, when you give to your home, when you give to your community, you're giving, you're giving, you're giving, you're giving. You can't do that with an empty cup. I actually am quite a visual learner, so I brought a little bit of tools for today. Coffee cup, if it's full, you get a nice bit of caffeine, but you're pouring out of the cup into other people, right? Well, it doesn't really work with an empty cup. It doesn't. There's nothing for you to give. So when your cup is full, as you give to other people, You're filled up. So, how can we fill up the cup? How can we get this cup full so when you pour out, when you give to others, you're not depleted? Because when you're depleted, it ain't pretty. I know, been there. I ended up with major, major health issues because I did not learn self-care when my babies were little. And it was not great. My kids had to, when they were growing up, they had to see me struggle with my health because I didn't take care of me. So I'm gonna help you so your babies don't have to go see the same thing. Sound good? So have you seen my, my other videos? I This is the third in a series of how to do self-care with the kids around. And so if you haven't seen them, head over to my YouTube channel, Kiyla Summer, and you'll find them. So, do we think we got that a little bit pretty much understood. What is self-care and why you need it? Super, super important. And today was gonna be the third of three, but I'm actually gonna give you a bonus. I'm gonna give you two today tips of how you can do self-care with the kids around. They may notice these. 
some of the other ones they probably won't, wouldn't notice, but these, they might, but you know what? It's going to be a good thing. So one way you can do it is grab a bottle of essential oil. Make sure you're using quality essential oils. Quality is important in everything. In, in your personal care products, your food, it's important. Quality is important. So how do you know if it's a quality essential oil? You do some research on the company, honestly. That's the best way I have found. And you want a company that's transparent. You want a company that says, hey, my farm's over here. Come on in. Let's take a walk around. That is a transparent company that's going to let you onto their farms where they're growing their, their oils. So if the company doesn't grow their own oils, uh, I wouldn't. You don't know where. Unless they're holding their farmers accountable. So how do you do it with an essential oil? Take the bottle, put a drop in your hand. There we go. Give it a little bit of a rub, get those molecules moving and inhale. So maybe the kids are playing or they're uh, watching a video or maybe dad's reading a book to them. Put that oil on, maybe even rub it on the back of your neck as long as it's not a hot oil. And not only will you be lifted up, but the whole family will because it'll affect the entire environment around you. That is a super, super simple way to do self-care right there with the kids. No big deal. Super, super easy. So what's my surprise? What's my bonus? Do you know that God created music? He did. He created music to bring us joy and joy fills up our cup. It totally does. So maybe you're in the middle of, of folding laundry. Oh, folding laundry. Never ending process. Oh my goodness. I was horrible about getting clothes folded. They could get washed and dried and I'd have four, five, six loads that needed to get folded. So what do you do? Maybe you're doing dishes. Dishes, in my opinion, are drudgery. Um, if it was good for the environment, I would probably live off of paper and plastic all the time. So I didn't have to do dishes, but it's not really good for the environment, not good for the budget too much either. So let me show you how to do some self care while you're folding laundry or doing dishes. If you didn't recognize that song, that's Boondocks by Little Big Town. And I love country. Maybe country's not your thing and that's okay. What music fills you up? What can you dance to while you're folding laundry or doing dishes? That's what you need to be doing. Doing, putting some music on and just dancing. The kids will enjoy it. Maybe you can even get them to fold a little bit or dry a dish or two. If, you're, if they're old enough, while you're dancing to your music. So those are my tips for today on how to take care of you while you still got the kids around. So remember to check out my YouTube channel that's going to have some other videos on other tips of how to take care of you. Remember, Mama, you got to fill that cup up. It's key for you and it's important for your kids your kids need to see you enjoying life they need to see you as a well-rounded parent well-rounded in 
adult. You're modeling great behavior for them when you do that. Have a wonderful, blessed rest of your day. Bye, folks.